Thank you for joining me on this Thursday morning. I'm glad that you came back to be with us, and I hope that you've been with us all week. Today, we want to continue our thought about being a learner of the Word of God, for as a learner, we know that we can be that witness and that testimony that Jesus has asked us to be, and we can win people to Christ and let them know that God really loves them and that they can have their sins forgiven and they can go to heaven. So we want to look at another scripture today that will help us understand how to be a learner of the word of God. And our scripture is found in the book of 2 Timothy chapter 3 starting with verse 14. But continue thou in the things which thou hast learned and hast been assured of knowing of whom thou hast learned them and that from a child thou hast known the holy scriptures which are able to make thee wise unto salvation through faith which is in Christ Jesus. All scripture is given by inspiration of God and is profitable for doctrine for reproof, for correction, for for instruction in righteousness, that the man of God may be perfect, thoroughly furnished unto every good work. What is Paul saying to Timothy today? He said, Timothy, you have to be a learner of the word of God in order that you can carry out the ministry that God has ordained you to carry out. And how do you be that learner, Timothy? It is to practice what you've been taught. Practice what has been preached to you. Oh, I wish that every believer, every church goer, every person who listens to the preaching of the gospel and the, the teaching of truth, I would that they would practice what they're being taught. I trust that you'll be a, a one who practices what you're being taught. I hope that you take what I'm sharing with you in Thoughts from the Throne and you will put it into practice in your life. For if you do, I guarantee you, according to the Word of God, that you be, will be that witness, you will be that testimony. And just watch out, you will some win someone to Jesus Christ. God bless you. I'll see you tomorrow.